basic or most important verses in the Bible is, for God so loved the world that he gave, and I'll just finish that up, that he gave his only begotten son. But the main part that I want to focus on is the love of God. I think so many times that we struggle with knowing that God loves us. And if we don't realize or recognize or believe or find it hard to believe that God loves us, we'll find it hard to believe that he cares about us or that he's concerned about our situation. And I think it's so important to think about how our own parents, if we had good parents, how our own parents loved us or how our own parents love us. And so if you think about that, or okay, let's think, forget about parents, but how you love your own children and the things that you would do for your children because you care about them and because you love them. First of all, most parents think the best of their children. Why? Because they're mine, because I love them. And I believe that God does that same thing. He thinks the best of us. And then if our children do something wrong, that um, we're quick to forgive our children. It's not just something where um, we're going to hold grudges against them, but God is quick to forgive us. Like I believe we're quick to forgive our own children. But even if we're not, God is so much better of a parent than we are. And he loves us and he cares about us. And I would say again that don't run from God. If you mess up, don't run from him. He loves you. I talked about this one time before, but that's something for us to hear again and again and again, that he loves you. He's waiting for you to come to him. He's waiting for you to turn to him, no matter what happened, no matter what you've experienced, no matter what you've done. So remember that. And also remember that it's our time now. God bless you and God loves you.